So one of my favourite projects has been supporting a company who assembled, built and tested a satellite communication device which has now ended up on the International Space Station. My name is Paul Caesar and I am the Infrastructure Manager for the Rail Space Building R100. So within Rail Space we design, test and assemble components to go onto spacecraft. So we don't design and build the whole satellite, but we'll design and test and assemble a component, a sensor, a camera or a communications device. We supply, maintain clean rooms that are ready for customers to use. Some of those customers may be internal customers to Rutherford, but we also supply clean rooms to external clients. So we make sure that the client has got a suitable, safe and certified environment to do their testing. This includes the big chambers where we will supply the clean room and operate the chamber for them. We vacuum it down and we can then heat it and cool it, which simulates the conditions the component will find in space. We need a clean environment to make sure any components that get sent into space are free of any contamination. We ensure the rooms are very closely controlled for environmental conditions such as temperature, humidity and cleanliness. So we also do monitoring. So within the clean rooms we have particle counters which draw a sample of air and then using a laser measure the number and size of the particles that are floating around in the room. We measure down to 0.3 of a micron. A typical hair is about 100 microns, so we are measuring particles down to a very, very, very small size. This is vital to prove that the space instrument has been built in a safe and proper certified environment. One of the aspects that drew me to applying for a job at Rouse Space was the prospect that I am supporting the space industry. It's not quite rocket science, but getting satellites and equipment on those satellites into space was very appealing to me.